Good morning. It's Saturday. Making pancakes. These are our easy peasy 100% plant based, so vegan, blueberry oatmeal pancakes we make in our Vitamix. Although any blender will do. We like to eat them on colorful. Please don't judge us plastic kids plates because oh, they're more fun that way. And well, these are also great for grown-ups, as you can see on this absurdly tall, only for a social media thumbnail stack. This recipe is in our seven Vitamix recipes to make first printable ebook. There's a link to it in the description and in the card on the right. At the end of this video, we'll answer the questions, where's mama's coffee cup and why do mama's gotta eat too? Here we go. Let's show you how to make these pancakes. Start with one cup, so that's 240 milliliters of almond milk. Really, any milk will do. One and a half cups, I think that's 135 grams of rolled oats. We'll add a quarter cup of aqua fava. That's water from a can of chickpeas. Literally means bean water if you're not familiar. It's a great and popular egg substitute. Is that aqua fava? Yeah, that's exactly what it is. Quarter cup, three quarters teaspoon of baking powder, half a teaspoon of cinnamon, two teaspoons of vanilla extract. We'll throw in a whole peeled banana and two pitted dates. All right. Okay. We'll put the top on, blend for about 30 seconds on the highest speed. Dada. That's not As true. You. This yeah. is Mama's coffee cup. <laughs> I think it's in the cabinet over there. They're like two white ones. Yeah, they're in the cabinet. And you'll have your own black one. Yeah. Ready? Yes. Go ahead. Blend ramp all the way up. It smells really good. It does smell good. I mean, cinnamon and vanilla. Oh, it'd be delicious. Beautiful. Excellent. Want me to show you one more time? Sure. Looks great, buddy. Onto a lightly greased pan or griddle uh, that's medium to hot heat. Add a quarter cup scoop of this pancake batter. Once, twice, three, four times, however much room there is. We did try adding chocolate chips instead of blueberries and it worked fine. It just, it kind of stuck to the pan, it kind of melted. We actually thought the blueberries were better. But it's the same method. Drop them on. We're using frozen blueberries, but fresh, local, organic, non-GMO from your backyard. It'd be great too if you can make that happen. Grab a handful, plop them on, and if you're a little bit type A like Shava, you can just place them evenly in odd numbers so they look and taste the best. Most pancakes bubble a little bit when they're ready to be flipped. These not so much. You just need to look at the bottom and flip after around two minutes or until brown. We could have probably waited a minute longer, but we had hungry boys waiting. Growing up, I never understood why people added butter to pancakes when you're gonna put syrup on it anyway, but it does add a little bit of richness and why not? It's the weekend. This blender pancakes recipe makes 12 quarter cup pancakes. So that's enough for two to three adults. We often double the recipe and store whatever is left in the fridge for a kind of quick reheat breakfast. I've heard of people baking the whole batch, so instead of standing over the griddle, you just pop it into the oven at 375 degrees Fahrenheit for 20 minutes and they're done. Guys, subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. Hit that bell to get notified. And if you appreciate videos like this, hit that thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you in the next one. Bye guys. Gotta get to you know. Bye. Bye. Bye.
why do mamas gotta eat them? Mama has a baby.